All right, third video here. We're actually showing you some pursuit with my Lamborghini. It happened to be uh, the easiest way I've found to find out what cars are the best is uh, hit your easy drive, which is right uh, directional stick, and you can actually check out each car and see where your current car settings are at uh, with speed and handling and toughness versus others. But as you can see, you actually gain points during a pursuit, and when you gain points, you actually move through the game kind of like a progression, uh, which is kind of cool. And the higher the heat intensity, uh, the more X SP you get. I'm not sure what SP means, but it's kind of cool. But you actually, I had a lot of fun actually taking out cops. And you're driving, and you kind of have this fun nature to yourself. And you're actually, well, you get come across these things, and then you can actually like run away, and they, they give you a little bit of time. Like right there, the, my PSN's freezing up a little bit. But uh, you know, they give you a little bit of time. You're like you're not like right now. I just wrecked. You know, normally the game would be over, but. I back out, see how it says busting at the bottom? You actually back out and kind of get away from it. Uh, they give it, so that makes it actually a lot more fun. Because, uh, you know, the previous new speed, as soon as you wrecked, you were pretty much done, I, from what I understand. Um, from what I can remember, um, the last one I played it was on PlayStation 1. I've had, heard a lot of friends do that, but I'm actually uh, still trying to learn the maps during this time. I've played a lot more since then. I had about an hour into it at this point. Now I'm up to about three or four hours gameplay time, and it's very, very funny. As long as you have the game in your system and it's on, it counts the timer. Uh, I don't think I think it keeps on counting even when it's on pause. But you can actually go through that parking garage there. You can go through a lot of things here. Uh, you try and find places to do jumps into billboards and earn some money. Now I could have busted through that, but the higher your heat level intensity, the the better the cars. Now as you can see, the first time was like Ford Crown Vicks, but now we actually have Chargers coming after us and uh, Ford Expeditions or Explorers doing the battering, uh, um, keeping the lanes like a roadblock so that's kind of neat what I like to do is I like to travel in between traffic and stuff and try and get the cops to spin out it's it's just fun I mean you can bang into them uh, you're as long as you're in that circle you're getting uh, you know tagged they're they're looking for you and then your heat uh, intensity goes up to level six in the higher level you can see my pursuit XP or SP is increasing with the level of the pursuit uh, with the level of the heat uh, the higher the heat now you're actually going to probably see some SWAT trucks coming up here soon but look at me yes I, I'm trying to practice on like looking back as I go forward but I was supposed to be able to jump through that hoop but I missed it I'm trying to practice on looking back while I'm going forward so that way I can show you guys some stuff but I'm very close to getting busted there but this Lamborghini gets out quick uh, it's definitely one of the better cars in the game and it helps we're up to level four right now so you're earning more uh, SP this is just a free roam I'm still free roaming now after every race that you race like once you enter a race you're racing through this and the cops pretty much follow you on every race almost uh, see there's the SUVs now the cops follow you on every race <clears throat> so part of racing the other players actually avoiding the cops too which is kind of nice because it kind of equalizes the game and, you know nobody really stays out front because the cops are after you and it's a lot of fun and once you get done with your race they they throw you back into this free roam right where you look I mean there's no change it's like you raced and it's still free roam and now you see right there that was kind of cool you kind of evade the cops and then you try now I've actually like hid before and they, they actually miss you and stuff it's kind of cool like if you go to the right place or you know jump off on an exit there's basically an interstate all the way around it's a lot of fun uh, enter to cool down which means I'm not in the circle but as soon as they were keep on driving forward I can get back into the heat range because my, um, you know, the level, the heat level is still there. If there's a heat level on you and a cop goes by you, he'll see you and he'll throw up the flag and get things going. But that tunnel over there, I could run through that tunnel, hit some billboards. Uh, the longest jump you can ever do, you know, uh, that's one thing that they actually keep track of. But again, my PSN is Rodman656. If you play this game and you have it and you've been playing it, please friend request me on PlayStation Network and I will accept that friend request. Tell me why your friend requested me some friend request and just put like NFS in it. That way I know it's up. Um, and then because I want to I want to compare myself to some of you so that way I see what I'm doing because I only have two friends and I don't even know if they're really playing it. So it's like, oh wow, you're the best in your friends list and I'm like well is that mean anything I don't know because I'm not really having any competition so 
I haven't tried any multiplayer yet. I usually don't waste my time with multiplayer. However, most of these races are only three minutes long. So we're talking about a potentially really nice multiplayer thing. So that's what I'm going to be doing next. I just have a... This was just free roam, folks. This was just running around the city. Uh, there's so much on this map. Once you think you have it figured out, it's not. Uh, in my last video, I showed you different cars that I unlocked and found in the free roam. And basically, as soon as you shut off your PSN and turn it back on, or you know, after a little while, they actually reset. And uh, some cars, they're not they're all hidden and you just got to go find them once you find them then they get unlocked and now you can use them for all their individual events increase their overall ratings of uh, their like tires and engine performance and stuff but um, pretty much that was pursuit I'm gonna be showing you some better pursuits and some more of the game in just a uh, moment so just stay tuned please subscribe that way you can see it follow me on Twitter at your and my PlayStation Network address is right there we'll talk to you later peace